Alright, what is up everybody? It's the Inhuman One here with uh, part one of the very first challenge run that I'm doing for Callisto Protocol. I haven't even beaten the game yet actually, so we're going to be trying a stun baton only challenge run. So before we begin, I want to kind of go and give you the parameters, right? So pretty much, stun baton only means I cannot give damage to any other weapon aside from the stun baton itself. <laughs> okay, is that any better? Hopefully that's better. Um, there was a setting that was changed on the back of my mic. There's three settings, one, two, and three, and one like picks up absolutely nothing at all. Okay, cool, cool, cool. So what I was saying, I had this awesome intro. Okay, so what I was saying is I'm going to do a challenge run of Callisto Protocol stun baton only. So the rules are, I can only deal damage using the stun baton, and I can't deal damage in anything else. I can use the uh, the power glove though. Is the volume okay again? Because I'm getting like really low value again. It seems like it's really quiet again. I don't know why. Once we figure out the volume, then I will definitely begin this run. But I'm seeing them really quiet again. blow up whenever we're mid-stream. Alright, let's see. No, it's still pretty low have the gain like so high too. Don't want to like kill you guys' ears. That's really annoying. How is this possible? Gain volume down okay even more I have it like at negative 30 decibels 
man, that sucks, because I, uh, have the gain up so high. I'll just keep the mic really super close, too. All right. So that's doable. We'll see if this works. If not, let me see. I can also kind of download the gear. The gain volume is pretty low right now. It's like 30 decibels. If it's still too loud, I can turn it down a bit. Let me see. It's really just the music, isn't it? When are we doing Bloodborne? Super busy lately. Well, I'm glad you stopped by, man. Uh, Bloodborne will happen soon. Um, I'm thinking... I've been doing like challenges for these new games that keep coming out. There's one other game that's coming out in December that I was going to play, and then there's two in January, Forspoken, and, uh, which is probably going to be terrible. And... Uh, Oh, it's Dead Space, duh. The better version of Callisto Protocol. So, um, so soon, soon, or DLC? <laughs> Ouch. Dude, I've been so busy, though. Like, I've been, there's been too many new games coming out. It'll probably be after DLC. Right? Wouldn't that make sense? I mean, because I gotta finish up Dark Souls with the DLC. I haven't even touched it. Um, I think after Christmas, hopefully things will kind of, no, I say Christmas, but after December, the turn of the year, everything will kind of be slowing down a bit. There will be some new games coming out in January, but if they're not any good, I'm not going to spend any time or, uh, or money on them. Not good. And that way I could jump into some Dark Souls 3. Uh, I wanted, I do want to beat uh, Bloodborne and uh, Sekiro Shadows Die twice as well, so uh, definitely want to check those out. But I've been having a lot of fun doing these challenge runs lately, so um, I probably will pop those little streams in schedule I guess you know but it's been it's been a lot of like rebranding and a lot of crazy stuff going on and trying to get more engagement because it's been really tough lately but um to just to get you know the stream going or get some activity in it but I've been focusing a lot more on YouTube and I just reduced my streams uh, from five times a week to three times a week so Sekiro and Shimon will die more than twice <laughs> yeah I'll die yeah, I'll die a few more times than that and then I'll do a challenge run later right we'll see but uh, yeah, I do want to revisit the Souls-like titles again. I want to beat the ones that I haven't played in forever or that I just haven't beaten in, 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 ge in general and then go back and do some challenge runs on them because that's kind of what I want to start focusing on more. It's a lot of fun for me. And um, I don't know. It's just it's better than just streaming a random game and, and you know, like I don't really have a goal to be other than just playing it to play it. I don't know. I just have a hard time doing that. But anyway, hopefully the volume is better now. Uh, I know it's still kind of quiet. I'm doing everything I can on the settings thing. Like, the games are maxed out. So I have no clue what else to do on this thing. Yeah, I have no clue. But anyways, uh, let's go ahead and get started. I did turn down the music and all that stuff, so it should be okay. Uh, we're going to go ahead and jump right in. It's stun baton only. That means I can only deal damage with the stun baton. I will be able to use the power glove for, like, uh, moving the enemies and holding them, but I cannot throw them into hazard. So, there you go. I can't use any projectiles either. Here, let's do this. No, no, I, I don't want to continue. My bad. My bad. I started this game, but um, I haven't beaten it yet. See, I started it this weekend. I couldn't even play it on Friday, so. We're going to go medium security, and then we're going to crank up the visibility. We're going to go creature in dark. So protocol. This is the intro. This chick is so annoying, by the way. Super annoying. And the whole game, I mean, I'm almost at, like, I don't know, at least midway through, and she's still a troll. You're gonna realize how much fun she is to be seen. If you wait. So yeah, I'll be screaming into the mic for you guys to hear me. Um, not sure what's going on with the volume. I think it's my cat. Yeah, it's my mic. You know, they, they run around sometimes and they knock stuff over. I'm pretty sure they knock down my mic or something. It's either that or the webcam. They're always knocking down my webcam. So pretty much, people, it's a, this is the future. We're in space. We're off. Specifically, I think, on Saturn. One of Saturn's moons. And, uh, created a prison on there called Black Island Prison. And we are not... And, uh, that character, he just flies to Tyler for a trip. Uh, takes cargo back and forth, so he Shocking doesn't know what that cargo is. So. 
in there. Hangar control, main reports for Europa station. Europa? You got something to say, you're gonna keep flicking that thing all day. I was watching that one. That's our last one on Earth. And I'm done talking about it. Then what do you want me to say? How about thank you? Because after this job, we're never gonna have to work another day in our lives. I guess you got it all figured out. Yeah, I guess so. Come on, man, what is this? Huh? Back and forth, Callisto to Europa, all this additional security. It's a prison moon, Max. They take the security pretty serious. And what about the attacks? Huh, how do you explain that? What, by the outer way? They've been hitting targets all over the sector for the past six months. We got a yellow light in the cargo hold. It's probably nothing. Well, it's still worth checking out. so much, you know? We live longer. All right, let's Port go. and starboard sensors are both showing errors. I'm still trying to figure hey, go out check the them out. but whatever. I'm going. I don't know what's taking a while. There's cargo, or we got the contraband pack, which is important. Uh, we can use that to get some credits early on in the game, and uh, we are going to need that. Are you going or what? should check out the rest of the ship. All right. We got that little auto save in the corner. And all we're doing right now is just checking to see if we know if there's anything else wrong with the ship. Uh, this is kind of just that <sighs> intro sequence to get used to the controls, learning Son how to bitch. vault, how to crouch, things like that. Well, I guess I'll check the other side. But it starts picking up pretty quickly, so... This is how you mantle, you just jump across, and there's a few crates like this that you're going to be doing this uh, to get to different places in the main game as well, so. Alright. Max, we got trouble. What's up? We've been boarded. Oh shit. Is the other way? Yeah, I'm guessing. Now, this uh, group Our called call. The Other Way has boarded the ship, and so now we got to be careful. It's what they call like a terrorist group, and they are um, led by that woman we saw in the very beginning scene, so. Dampening field's still in effect. Not for long. <sighs> what do they want? How should I know? And there's so much shimmying and crouching and stuff in this game. It, it gets, kind of, you know, that's Almost like how they time. break up just the normal walking. But I don't know. It, it's just more so for them to create like opportunities for jump scares and things like that. Let's go. Let's go. There he is. Stop him. Max, they're heading for the bridge. Open up. What are you gonna do? Whatever I have to. You would think yes. that'd be cool to do black. What is it? Hold on! I'm on my way! Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. We can actually climb here. This is pretty cool. Watch out! Oh, God. Warning. Venting atmosphere. 
Jacob, get up here! Control the mine station! Transfer and flight control! This is bad, Jacob! Mayday, mayday, mayday! This is UJC Charon! Returning to Callisto! Requesting emergency clearance! Yeah. Negative, okay. UJC Charon. You are not totally authorized dead. for re-entry. Sorry, but I got no choice! We're coming in hot! Boost the anti-grass! Already at maximum! We're not gonna make it! Yes, we are! Watch out! Hold on! Straight for impact! So that happened, and it starts off pretty crazy actually, um, so we're just transporting cargo, crash landed because our ship got boarded by some terrorist group, and now, uh, we're just now waking up from the crash, and you'll see what happens next. As soon as the cutscene's done, I'm gonna fix the, uh, the settings for the screen shake, that way I don't... I told you not get all sick. I told you not to hurry. Man, I get motion sickness like crazy with games like this. Hey, Max. Max. Hang on, buddy. I'm coming. Oh. Oh, hey. Chico. Chico. His teeth are oh, in like random. Oof. I need you They're all up in there. Listen. He still had his wisdom teeth, it seems. Hey, 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 come on. Come on. Oh, it's God okay. It. You can buff that out. I don't know how he, his face did that. I see nothing there that could have caused that. These guys are jerks. One life part. sign detected. They find ways Continuing to search. pretty much just slow your progress throughout the game. They don't Black do anything security. to kill the enemy. Yeah. And him? Is he still up? Yeah, we'll just need the one. Okay. Uh, let's get you out of here. Manifest says you were running cargo out of the hangar. Don't get many of you freelancers out here. I was just doing my job. Don't I know it? <laughs> First ship I ever lost. We were boarded by. Let go of me! Her! Her! She's the one who. Hey! Oh, your jets, cargo jockey. You do your job. You let me do mine, huh? Sir. Yes, sir. Whatever you say. Grab him too. Stop! Uh, hey! What are you doing? Hey! And now we are in the of the Black Iron Prison, just like that. There's still a lot more. Hey, I'm innocent to go. And once we get through all that junk will be able to play some games. Now, in the beginning, it's kind of interesting because you get a, I guess it's like a pickaxe first, and then immediately after the pickaxe, you're going to get the stun baton. So, I will have to use the stun baton for a spell. The fuck are you looking at? <laughs> Why? Huh? Well, that's not very nice. Way too late for this shit. Okay, uh, inmates, do not speak unless they are spoken to. Wait, there's been a mistake. My name is Jacob Lee. I'm not an inmate. You were inmate. 532-521. You 
to address me as Captain Ferris. What? No, no, no. I'm just a cargo pilot. I was attacked by the outer way, by her. She crashed my ship and she killed my first officer. I don't care. Warden Zoys. Oh, speak of the devil. Rejoice. And rejoice in your life that's led you here. To this moment. To this place. The only place where you truly belong. To find the one thing that has always been missing. A purpose for your meaningless life. This is Warden Cole. And together, we will find that purpose. Welcome to Black Iron. I'm gonna try to mic a bit, see if it works. So that seems way louder. And then we have this other setting. Loud, loud, loud. Alright, now I'm gonna reduce the gain. All right, hopefully that's better, guys. I uh, made some adjustments on the mic. Super annoying. That's the glove that we're going to be using for the majority of the... Well, I say the majority of the playthrough. I think it's going to help us get through some of the tougher sequences. There's some really tough parts that I have no clue how I'm going to get past. Um, but just to kind of paint the picture here... You can die in like three hits. It, it, it's so easy to die in this game. And I'm going to be relying primarily on melee. And all the enemies for the most part can do melee. Some have range attacks as well. But we're, we're pretty much screwed. It's going to be a hard challenge. I think I fixed my mic. I uh, had to adjust a few things on the actual mic itself. So the volume should be much better now. Oh, they're just showing all their secrets uh, just right there in that lab. We're actually um, come back to this medical bay area. And we see a little bit more about what's going on. But to my knowledge, it's like it's literally just dead space with a slightly different origin story. But it's the same exact game, just worse gameplay. <laughs> ah. Oh, those are going to come in handy. We use those quite a bit. And because I won't need any um, ammunition, I'll have plenty of space for health injectors. Plenty of space. All right, let's do this. So we wake up and... We're like, hey, must have been a bad dream. But we're still in the cell. So we look around, blah, blah, blah. That's my inmate number, pretty cool. Go this way, nothing. Oh, there's a purple cube there. That, that's a recurring image. I have no clue what it means, but you see it throughout. Hey, <laughs> not very nice. Now we've got a fresh haircut, new set of clothes, and everything's on fire. But fear itself. Well, duh. Alright, so the challenge run begins. Remember, stun baton only to deal damage. We can use the GRP glove, but we cannot throw enemies into hazards. The only way we can deal damage is with the stun baton. So we're, we're going to need to go ahead and explore as best we can. 
level up our stun baton to the max and beat the game hold on let me check my settings real quick okay camera shakes reduced to like zero I love it all right let's go talk to this bro Elias All right, and drops are enabled. So anybody that has this game, uh, you know, you have until pretty much today, the end of today, to watch uh, this for thirty minutes. And if you do, you get the gore skin, which I'll go ahead and put on for you guys. I think it's here. Let me see. Hmm. Forget exactly where it's at. I think it's in the original options actually because that's where you can get the uh, pick your, your suits. It's a really weird way to do it. I looked at it I was like, what? Yeah, I guess not. I see no way for us to do this. Okay, no worries. We're going to shimmy through here and then we're going to use our shiv. The shiv's important because um, it's just a tool that we use throughout. It's good for stealth kills. Uh, and also, you can't use it just to strike, but you can only use it for stealth kills or to get enemies, like small enemies, off of you. Um, and it's also a tool used to, like, uh, break into, like, fuse boxes and things like that. All right, so here we go. All the inmates are just frolicking about. There you go. And there's jump scares like every five seconds. So after a while, you just, you're just you not afraid of them. Gotta love that quick time event door opening sequence. Get him. Get him. Ow. Yes. And this is like the only quick time event that I've seen. Oh my gosh, so far. Gotcha. Ooh. Now we will use this, but it's only a temporary weapon. I honestly wish you could keep this weapon. Um, it's a nice, nice weapon. I mean, it stabs or whatever, and it's got, it's like, you know, like a big hammer. So it's got like... A strong attack and it's got like sh sharp points as well I think it's cool but you don't get to use it for too long actually hey friend really you're a jerk this idiot won't die I actually died to him the very first time I played this multiple times. I was like, the hell is wrong with this? I didn't know how to dodge, though. So. Let's go ahead and open up Elias's cell as well so he can get out, and then we're going to meet up with him. That should do the trick. All right. So, sadly, we're not going to be able to use this for too long. It is called, I think, the, the hammer or the pickaxe. The crowbar. So, it won't last. Let's go on and uh, head over to our new friend. Touch. 
All right, so a lot of the doors and stuff like that will open up on the sequences after cutscenes. So it's you know doors and areas that were previously inaccessible, they get accessible pretty quick. All right, there's gonna be some bros. We got this bro. I don't like to block, so I'm not gonna block. Oops. Apparently, I don't like to dodge either. Get wrecked. Give me that arm. And then you stomp on him. When you stomp on him, like, you can get stuff. And this, you can't hit him through walls, so that'd be really cool if you could, but you can't. So we took that first guy out. We're going to work our way around here. We need to find the elevator. And if I can remember, I'm going to show you guys where the secret rooms are as well. Because I'm just nice. Even though it's a challenge run, I'm just that nice. I right, what the heck? I think I did the same thing last time. Oh yeah, I was like... Wait, can I climb this? No. Let's go through here. Yeah, I did the same thing last. I was like, where did I go? Why? Alright. Whoa, 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 whoa. We got the save point so we know we're in the right area. What is happening? Oh. Don't you do it. You only have one arm and you're still kicking my butt. Get wrecked. Give me them Callisto credits. That dude's eating somebody. Hopefully he stays in there. This is our first little health thing, and we will need it. We're going to need lots of these, actually. So I am going to use the health injectors, uh, but I'm going to save them up as much as possible for the later sequences because this game gets pretty tough. I haven't beaten it yet, just so you know. I've only played a few hours of it. Big robot dude. Did he say do not speak? It's not very nice. Elias, something's wrong with the elevator. I'm heading down, not up. He's like, yeah, that's how elevators work. Oh, we're going the scenic route. That's going to get sucked up. We know that, right? We've seen too many horror games. Yeah, come on. Challenge me. Challenge me. Access hall, okay. Energy converters are going to be important as well once we get to the reforge uh, places because that's going to allow us to upgrade our weapon. Nice. All right. Open it. Sounds like you see that guy. I called this one too. Are you dead? He's dead. Why is he dead? I never understand that. Did he like get taken away or what? Or did he just like go down there to explore? He's like, yeah, I'm just going to check out around here. Let's see. Got some credits.
And yet another heavy door we have to open with our fingertips. Love it. Okay, I think we're good now. Run, boy. Monsters. I always check the contents of the box because sometimes, even if you open it, if your inventory is full, you won't pick everything up. It only pick up a few random items, so you're then forced to kind of juggle your inventory a bit. As I said earlier, I'm going to do my best to try and show you the secret rooms if I can remember the locations. Processing. Thank you. We got another elevator. Lovely. The security units, like I said earlier, are pretty jerky. Lethal force has been authorized. Has like a shotgun. Area secured. Moving to medical sector. Lovely. That's where I'm going. Sneak past the security units. Well, I don't plan on fighting them. Scanning for active core signatures. That's terrible. I right, keep going, keep going. Medical ward. Scanning for movement. Oh no! Don't do that. Don't do that. Crouch. No activity detected. No, no, we're good. Don't turn around. Black iron security unit active. Why is he not moving forward? All systems nominal. Wait, why? <laughs> Seriously? He just keeps going back and forth. Okay, is there anything I can grab here? No. I'm gonna open this door then. Come on. He's gonna turn back around, I just feel it. No movement detected. Okay. Okay, good. Just making sure I didn't miss anything. Wait, what? Is he turning back this way? I don't get this guy. He's kind of everywhere. Your scanning methods suck. Okay, he's over there now. Good gosh. I'll get this health uh, injector. He's just going that way. That's great. You stay over there, Brosif. For now. Okay. Gonna stab this little bro. That's the shiv. That's perfectly fine. I don't think there's anything in here. Oh, lovely. Yeah. Just a trap. 
Love that. I can just pop this open. Nice. So we'll go in there in a second. Let me see if there's anything else over here. Mm, no. Let's go in here. Get some goodies. I want all the credits and all the heals I can possibly get. All the ammo will be sold. And we'll just convert those into credits. Nice, look. Very, very nice. Let's go in here, see if there's any cool loot. Energy converter, more health. I'll go ahead and use the health as a matter of fact. Top off our health for now. Look at that, it's that good stuff, okay. And then we're gonna go ahead and come this way. Grab some of these little credits here. More credits. And you only get like, I mean, literally single digit credits at a time. Like 12 is like, wow, it's like, you only get like seven and stuff. So it's really, it really stings you with the credits, you know? What's in here? All that for 14 credits. That's freaking awesome. Bro. You better die. He just won't die. Okay. Got our health back at least. Now it's like super foggy. That's a big boy. Oh, gosh. Broke his arm off. You only have one arm, and yet you're still kicking my butt. Okay. Okay. He got me there. He's got me fair and square, big guy. He still was able to get me? Wow, okay. So I got jacked up pretty good. I am gonna heal again, because I'm hurting. Didn't quite top off my health, but... Yeah, it's gonna be one of those runs. I can already feel it. I'm gonna be honest with you, I don't feel like I really benefited from that area I got like a hundred credits max I was relatively worthless taking my fuse back all right this is where I got ambushed by that creature Wait, can I let, just go see what's over here though? I'm gonna, I'll, I'll use this again, but hold on. Okay, this is open. Oh, that's why. What about here? Okay. Oh, am I locked in here? Okay, never mind. Um. And this is kind of where we started, right? I had to go this route. Go through all these doors. Yeah, this is dumb. Let's leave. 
I thought there was going to be other areas we could explore, but I don't see anything like it. So what we're going to do is grab this uh, fuse. See what's up here. Good stuff. He's alive. These guys just don't freaking die. Alright. They have tons of health. You have to dodge everything. If you, have, if you want any chance to make it. So you're going to security control room, okay. And it's scary in here. Got the health. If you guys are sensitive to light, just look away for a moment. It's incredibly dizzy. I'll get out of here quick. Alright. Get up in here. Oh, just invents. Oh. Oh gosh, can they see me? They see me. Crap. No. Give me that arm. Why won't you die? Okay, he's he's scared. He knows what's up. What? Why did he just escape? Is he going to pop back up? I guess I could have knocked him into these. Yeah, so they just like to explore in the vents. Interesting. Well, here I thought I was going to get attacked 2v1, but we're good. Oh, yeah. And now the challenge truly begins. Not just. Ooh wee. And he just tosses that. It's like, bro, that would have been great. But the stun baton will deal significantly more damage. Alright, this is where the run begins. So I'm going to put stun baton. Got to drop those markers, you know? Okay. Are you going to open it for me? Brosif? I never know where the hell to go in this game. Oh. Press buttons. We're hacking into the prison mainframe right now. Oh my gosh. Yeah, get some. Okay. So it's way better, right? I think so. Again, we're going to have to be very, very cautious with our health. So I don't think I can get in here. Yeah, it's just something you can't even interact with. Lovely. Got 
at a checkpoint finally. It's been a while. All right, so let's see. Uh, okay, I thought that was a ladder. That's not a ladder. Okay, we're going to go this way then. We'll go ahead and grab our heels. I'm going to hold on to that one. Wait. Do I go back here? Mm -mm. Get wrecked. Give me health. None of these. Oh my gosh! None of these guys have health. How'd you, you know, break your arm? How are you not dead? I'm dead. Okay, that's fine. Oh, that's the first death, huh? Always the most bitter. That's okay. The visibility is what messed me up. I didn't think he was still going to be able to attack me through that tiny corridor either. It's pretty narrow. But he still got his little skinny ass in there. Trying to see what. Oh my gosh, where the other one came from. And he just grabbed me. That's great. Got that health, baby. The skinny ones aren't in a straw. Oh my gosh. Where are all y'all coming from? I'm gonna let him come out here. And he's gonna grab me. Hit him in the head. Dead. Dead. Alright, the hell was that about? What's over here? Is this where I came from earlier? I think it is. Yeah, it is. It is. That was the uh, control room where we first opened everything up. Okay. And we got some more. Yeah, come on through here. Get wrecked. Yep. And he's dead. Give me that. Ugh, son. Alright, not bad. Not a terrible start. <laughs> We got Elias' stuff here. Let's go ahead and escape. We'll take this lift up. Oh yeah, Captain Ferris. All right. No. Yes. <laughs> so the warden wanted him. That's interesting. Oh. 
Well, that's no good. I feel like someone like that won't die that easily. Uh, where? Oh. The door! Security checkpoint. Inmate, inmate, inmate. Nice. Pretty smooth so far. Pretty smooth. Oh, gosh. This is where one of the secret rooms is located. I'll see if I can remember how to get there. I may not. <laughs> About that. Ugh, die. He's not going to die. Service required? Yeah, just a bit. Prisoners, prisoners. Oh my gosh. I was making fun of the security bot. What good that did me, huh? Okay, Mr. Backhand. How do you like that? Kill. Okay. Get wrecked. Give me some... Healing gels. I'm hurting right now, though. I don't like that. I don't like being so low. Looking for health, looking for credits, all that good stuff, you know? I right, shimmy through here. Run. There you go. That a kid. Nice. Okay, we got. Pretty much full health. Uh, as long as I'm in the green, that makes me so much more comfortable. Uh, we're going to grab these credits. Or whatever is in here. Minding my business. What are you doing? Full health. I love it. Look at that. Love it. Let's shimmy through here. That dude's dead. Oh, he got him a gun, too. Or, yeah, I'm not going to print a weapon, sadly, because I can't, right? I can't use them. But uh, we did get the pre-order bonus, which uh, gives us the ability to upgrade our weapons and stuff. So we'll be doing that. Let's see. Um, well, all we need to do is just go ahead and go here first. We're going to sell, I guess, anything we can. So ammo and all this. So um, let's think through this. All these energy converters, of course. Contraband packs is going to give us a nice chunk of uh, cash as well. It says 800 or whatever, but it gives you like 1,000. And hand cannon ammo. I'm going to sell all that too. Gives you like nothing, but that's okay. And now, I refuse to craft this weapon, sir. It won't let me move. It won't let me. I have to craft it. Well, I'll craft it, but um, and use eight hundred bucks. But I'm not gonna use it. What a freaking waste. Scripted moments. Okay, got it. If we're gonna get out of here, we need a ship. One that you can fly. Now, I found an inmate with the skills to hack the network and call him down from orbit. Maximum security. Fucking suck it in here. 
Lovely. Okay, so I want to waste. Okay, now I can go here. Let's see. Hmm. We're going to keep popping this thing in here as much as possible. We're going to give it all the upgrades. I want to get this thing as powerful as possible. So now we have a new swing. Damage upgrade, hells yeah. There you go, already, you know? That's all it takes. Contraband pack for the pay to win, baby. And let's see what else we got. That probably, I have, yeah, 200 left. I don't, I don't think I even have enough for anything at this point. That's okay. Increased velocity. Okay, enhances swing. Okay. Nice, that's a big swing. Okay, I like it. Alright, let's do this. Ooh, is the electricity a different color too? It's like yellow now. Nice. What's up? Hey, that's a... Oh, yeah. I hate these guys. He's like, yeah, that was good. We can't shoot. There you go. I was gonna say, are you gonna make me shoot, bro? Seriously, okay. I thought it was gonna force me to shoot. That was very scary. I picked up the hand cannon ammo. That's okay. Um, we're gonna have to sell it. Now, one thing I just realized is the blood worms are going to be a problem. Because there's no way for me to attack them from a distance. Ah, oh, it sucks. That's alright. Let's head over to wherever the hell. I guess the shoe. Maximum security prison stuff. And we can use stealth kills as well. It's all melee, so. Callisto credits. I should say that, right? Melee only instead of stun baton only. Or no weapons. No guns. I don't know. Help me think of what I should name it. Should it be... I think Stun Baton only, to be honest. That's the only way I'm dealing damage, but... Oh my gosh. Get wrecked. Oh no. He's doing the thing. Oh gosh, I missed. How did I miss? How did I miss? Oh, my legs. Everything hurts. How are you alive? I want to die. I am dead. Shoot. Okay. Nah, I think stun baton only works. Get 
get wrecked. Okay, he hit me just as hard. We will not meet Nobunaga. How's he blocking everything? I knocked his head off. He knocked my head off. Okay. We traded. Alright, this two-headed guy... <laughs> Uh, it's kind of strong. I'm going to have to be much more patient with those big guys. damage give me that hell well that was sweet oh, we got that over there that works you can actually do that <laughs> I was just playing so if it's not like the crazy glass you can just bust right through it that's insane Yeah, that's cool. I got hand can ammo. Not that I can use it, but you know. Anything counts. We can sell it for credits. I really don't want to die, so let's make it past here very carefully. Need to get to the next save point. Is that where the blood worm gets me? The hell all right let's come up through here this reminds me of batman hey buddy <laughs> system system Can I stealth kill you guys? Because there's way too many of you guys here. Come on. Get in that sweet spot. Okay. Oh. Well, how the hell? Come on, genius. Don't turn around. Why would you turn around? Gotcha. Alright, nice. I don't know why I keep picking up the ammo. I guess I need it. Harvest implant. Oh yeah, this is awesome. I remember this. <laughs> and... It's not so bad. Nice. Now we have access to that door. So we got the laundry room here. Let's see if we can find any heels or like some credits or something. Nothing in there. I'm assuming I can break all this glass, right? Oh. Maybe it's not glass. This is glass. So there was nothing here. How depressing. The hell? Alright, time to stealth. Actually, time to save. I haven't saved. New manual save? Uh, yes.
Once I clear out this area, I'm like, oh gosh. What is that noise? Oh, he's in here. Okay. I'm going to try and show you guys where to go. Okay, so we're going to try to find the secret room here. Oh my gosh. After we clear out these enemies. Get hit in the face hard. And then die. Yep, that works. Is there no one else? Let's see. Let me clear out the area first, because this is scary, bro. Wait, let me see the door again. Uh, okay. I think this is the correct pathway, but I'm going to actually show you guys from the beginning how to get there. a bro right over there it's in that supply room area but I'm gonna go all the way back I want to show you guys how to get there so and he just crawled away so that's fine bruh okay so oh my gosh Get wrecked. Why are you still alive? Behind you. Behind you. Oh, son. Woo. Okay. Now I'm pissed. Trying to do a tutorial here. All right. All clear. So let me show you. Let's grab this stuff real quick first. Oh, no, that's the right way. I don't want to go that way. I get so mixed up in this game because, again, every time there's a checkpoint, you know you're going the right way. So, Oh, lovely. So here we are from here. Secret room number one. Let me just create a marker. Alright, here we go. Don't mind all the creatures that will jump at you. They don't bother anybody. I'm going to go straight through here. Open this passageway. Now that door is going to be locked, but instead you're going to crawl through... The nice bloody vent there. And these secret rooms offer a bit of lore about the secret operations that were going on in Black Iron Prison. Not even operations, more so just experiments based on some stuff they had found. Well, this is like the longest pathway ever. All right. Gonna go down a few staircases here. All right, and then you'll see a symbol that's kind of neat. It always kind of indicates like that you're headed the right way, or you found something super secret. It's like some weird insignia, and that's it right there. Go inside and look. 
You usually get some pretty cool loot. And some lore. All the L's. Hand cannon ammo. I'm gonna have to drop some of it. Let's go ahead and use a heal. The ammo doesn't give us a, a bunch. Let's see. Pristine energy converter. All right. You come in here and you can see all the... There's like a secret room here. Duncan Cole. I'll play it for you guys. Alright. So that's how you get the uh, first secret room. This is going to be useful for an achievement you can get later on. Alright, so now we got to get out of here. And all the while, we're going to be focusing on upgrading the power of the stun baton and everything else we can do to just keep our damage output as high as it needs to be. And we'll farm up health and stuff along the way every chance we get. So, all right. Now that door is opened up. You know, I'm curious. Because I don't think I went this other way last time, and I'd like to check it. That way seems to be a, a way I, you can actually progress through the game. But I've never actually gone, I don't think, to this other side. So let's do that real quick, because I'm feeling kind of confident in our health and skills. Oh, yeah, I do remember this. Do I? Oh, yeah, I do. The good old washer dryer sequence. Nothing in there, naturally. Monster! What are those? How oh, he should have said it. Oh, look at this. Credits, credits. We got the health and everything. We'll take this dude's implant because why not? And we'll grab whatever's in here as well. Let's see. I always look down to see. Okay. Look at all the stuff that is left behind. Okay. We're going to drop some ammo. I'm going to turn this way so I can drop it. Because you literally just drop it at your feet. I mean, that's ridiculous. Pristine energy converter. Hand cannon ammo. Hand cannon ammo. What about that heal, baby? Okay. So in that case, I'll go ahead and drop this other stack. You only get 10 per bullet. So, I mean, it, it's, it's relatively worthless to try and sell bullets. If I can carry more energy converters, then I'll do that. Bullets. Callisto credits. And... Nothing? Oh. More credits.
and bullets. Okay. Well, that was nice. I do remember this area. I just don't remember how to get out, apparently. Okay, now we're going to go all the way across and then to the left. Trigger that next point. I'm so glad I showed you guys that first secret. You can use that um, to get a one of the rare achievements. There's monsters. Oh my gosh. Really? Die! There you go. So you better give me health for that. Jerk. I'm afraid of the blood worms. I'm not sure how to deal with them yet. Also, I don't remember when they first show up. That's going to be scary too. Let's open this with our fingertips. No jump scare? Oh, uh, <laughs> this area. He's getting much more efficient at ripping out those implants. Gotcha. Alright. We got the Callisto credits. We'll leave the hand cannon ammo in there. Okay. He's just running around. Just having a good time. I'm gonna shimmy through here. Oh, gosh. This is where we get our our glove. This is great. I ha I never use it, and uh, my like I only played this game for maybe I don't know five hours. I've oh, never used it, uh, only but a few times. So I don't even know how to really work it. Nice. So I'm gonna have to find out how to use it more efficiently this go around you know okay so there's a, like a lock there to grab objects l2 and x to grab okay i rarely use it oh yeah Whoa, ball. Hey, what's going on? We don't know. Get hold of it. I'll get it out of the setting. Hurry. Oh, nope. That's not going to work. He's like, come on. You want some? Yeah. So this is pretty much what happens whenever you get infected. Your eyes change color. I guess you have a chance of dying. Your heart gets all jacked up, and then that stuff. Virus H8. Or hate, if you're cool. Lovely. Hi -ya. Oh gosh, that didn't work. Get him in the face. Your face. All right. Oh my gosh. Yeah, that's gonna be nice to stop me from getting hit. Really? Get out of here, bro. I'm dead. <gasps> he knocked my arm off. Okay. 
I don't want to get surrounded like that again. And I think that's a reasonable thing to ask for. It's like, oh. How are you not dead? I need gel. Did I die? No way. You know, also, I think I might have damaged him by bumping into his friend. So I can't, I gotta be very careful. I can only pull him towards me, I guess. Because I don't want, I don't want to inflict damage with that telekinetic glove. Alright, I gotta be careful with that then. I don't know how I didn't get, how I didn't dodge that actually, but that's okay. I get, oh gosh. Am I dead? Get wrecked, kid. No! He will not die. How are you alive still? You gotta heal, man. Where'd that third one? The third one didn't even come out. My gosh. What was that about? I think I got some Callisto credits in here, right? Oh, health. Lovely. Lovely. Jeez Louise, man. I have no clue where the third one went. Because he didn't show up this time. But I'm okay with that. I'm not going to complain. Fuse required. Did I not grab the fuse? Of course I didn't grab the fuse. Can I just break this? Thank you. Walkings for chumps. Alright, watch the third one come out now. Oh my gosh. Yep. Good gosh. Get wrecked. Where'd the other one go? Callisto credits. Give me all that money. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and uh, get to the next checkpoint because that's an annoying sequence. I'm going to see where I'm at with all this stuff. I got two heals. Okay. Not terrible. Oh yeah, okay, so I am gonna heal. I was I don't feel like dying, but I have to, okay, so now I have that little comfort here because I can go ahead and grab this. Destroy these, get some credits. I don't need the hand cannon ammo, but 
Oh, so that green. Okay, that makes sense. Green is health. Uh, let me see something. Okay, full battery for that. Now that's great. More health. Naturally, they're just pouring on the health now. That's just so cool. Gotta love it. Oh, I got a reforge right here. Pick up all this darned ammo. We're gonna sell all these pristine converters here. Look at that. And then we can sell hand cannon ammo. Matter of fact, why not? You know, we're not going to be lazy about it. We're going to go ahead and grab all of this as well. Any other hand can Okay, that was only the health. Oh, there are some here. Okay, great. Five bullets. I mean, that's 50 bucks, right? 50 credits. UJC printing. Have ignited day. Okay. Now we can buy the next upgrade. Let's see. Oh, actually, no, we can't. Uh, that's 2,700. Blocking counterattack. I don't like blocking. Block break. Hmm. Probably gonna need to go ahead and get that block break because every time they they do they, they've blocked my strikes so many times and you guys have seen it. So this is gonna set me back on the damage front, but at least they won't be able to block my attacks, right? And I'll be able to have increased DPS. That's fine. I'm okay with that. I wish you could see the upgrades and stuff and the enhancements on the stun baton, considering it's a, like your main weapon. Okay, let's see. So now we got that. Yeah, I don't really care about that one much. And then what we'll do after that is I suppose we can upgrade our gauntlet, yeah. Okay, so after we get this last upgrade here, I think we're good. So they shouldn't be able to block my attacks, right? Let me go back and see what it says. We'll break the ascents when they block an officer's attack. Okay, yeah, I love it. Not blocking nothing. Here's all the credits, but oh my god, it's not enough. The face hugger. I want your hugs. Alright. Now where the hell do I go? I guess I can grab this health. Top off my health. Where am I supposed to go? <laughs> this game is so confusing. I don't even know which door I came from. Maintenance? I don't know if I came through here or not. I guess not because I got a, a, a checkpoint so you must be doing something right. Oh yeah. These guys. Somebody redecorated. Look for an elevator. Okay. Absolutely nothing over here. Like, who did that? Lockdown.
<laughs> nice and easy. I think not. Alright. This is going. So far, the run's going pretty smooth. I'm, I'm shocked. Language. Alright, very nice. We stuck the landing. Okay, that right there is gonna do something. I wonder if I can just like. See, what are we gonna do about this? Because I'm gonna get uh, attacked every time by these blood bugs or whatever they're called. <clears throat> That's fine. Even if we know where they're at. That takes away a good chunk of health. Yeah, that's okay. I mean, it is what it is. Wait, what? Oh, somebody's running around the vent. Why are there, like, the vents so much? That's why. So we can get to me. Get wrecked. He looks like an old man. I like the little skinny ones. Let's fight more of those, please. That's another one. See, I can't do anything about it, though. See, you can always use that, but it doesn't make sense for me to damage them that way. Just gotta tank it, which really sucks. I don't know how many times I gotta press triangle. Yikes. Those deal quite a bit of damage. Okay, we're going to have to be very careful. Cautious. Oh, we're going down to the... Oh my gosh! The basement level. I'm dead. He's giving me a noogie. Okay. He just UFC'd me to death. I don't know why they're so violent. goes through here and he pops out of here, right? Broke your arm. Didn't I? Uh. Alright, he's dead. Give me some heals. Very nice. We're going to need it because we're going to get jacked up by this uh, creature over here. I wish you could dodge it, but I don't know how to dodge them. I mean, yeah, I'm pressing triangles as fast as humanly possible. What? No way, that's awesome, but I press triangles so much. Wow, okay. And I had more health. It's not like I had such little health, you know? I don't get that. Let's try that again. They're going to be a problem as it is. Oh, he's going to stand there. That's great. Take hits. I better get some healing gel out of this. Bud.
Oh, I have an idea. I think it just means how however close you get to it. I was too close to it, that's all. Okay, so it's not even about really the button presses. You see how I ran up? I was trying like to dodge its whatever neck thing. I get it, okay. It's all making sense now. Alright, that's right, my bad. We should not be dying to this e in this easy sequence, but it happens. Come on. Yeah, somehow he got the first hit. That was weird. Got some Callisto credits this time. I'm going to keep my distance. Stay away from that blood worm. Okay. Now there's no way it should get to us, right? Unless... Okay. Now I'm scared of those things. Didn't used to be. We're going to heal up so we can just take out this last enemy here and then just get through this part because that's... Annoying. We've died way too many times to such easy enemies. There you go. Callisto credits. Only eight? That's what I'm used to seeing. Just the single digits. What the ball was that? I didn't even see that. I'm pressing triangle. I don't know how fast. Okay. Any fast and hard, my freaking controller is going to break in half. I'm like t -t -t mashing it over here. Everybody just calm down. There's this bro. Okay. He's big. Big guy. Golly. Okay. There's a little loot box over here. Nice. Pristine energy converter. Is there any health? Nope. We'll take this dude's implant. I only have one heal. Oof, not good. Go ahead and top off. Because it's getting pretty crazy here. Wait, 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 wait. I hear somebody. Hmm. Bunch of those dudes. Uh. All right, can I stealth kill these bros? Don't turn around. He turned around. What the ball? He just teleported through the wall. I'm dead. Ow. No! Get wrecked. Oh my gosh. I'm dead. Punch, punch, punch. Just cover your face, bro. Okay. That was fun. Alright, let's see if I can actually get a stealth kill on these fools. Just making sure that it registered I picked that up. Um the little crazy one is really the biggest threat. Stab, stab. Oh my gosh, there he is again. Where did you come from?
I'm so dead. Can't see your little skinny bodies. I, I bet there's one behind me, right? Yep. Oh, the moves. Get wrecked. Why would it save there? In the worst possible spot. Okay, that works. Get punched. Both your faces. I need health. Like, hard. I got a health injector. That's cool. Callist 91. Look at that. Come on, give me some health. GRP battery pack. Yeah, that was ridiculous. Another battery pack. I didn't even use the stupid battery packs. I should have used my glove, but um, just to kind of hold creatures in place. Oh, the gate fuse is right there. Uh, let's see. So there is a gate fuse over by the the dead dude too though in the beginning. So like if we drop down here, I don't know why. Do I? I don't know if you have like fatigue, but like he can't. Sometimes he doesn't run when you hold L one. It's really annoying. We're gonna come back around here. Should be it, right? Don't remember walking so much, but I guess I did. Nice. Got a little ventilation shaft here we can walk through. Nice. This is the other side of where we were just at. With those two-headed dudes. Energy converter. I need that for the... The credits. Ooh. Skunk gun schematic. Skunk gun. I wonder if it's like a... I don't know, like tear gas. You know, whatever it is. It would make sense. One thing is that I hope it doesn't cost me money to craft it like it did last time. Because I, I don't want to... I mean, it serves me no purpose to craft a weapon that I can't use. So if it makes me craft, I'm going to be really pissed. Because I want to save my credits for, at this point, the last upgrade for my baton. And then my gauntlet. The Nintendo Power Glove, that is. I got that too, apparently. The hell? Like, what is wrong with this character? Like, he just doesn't want to move. I'm holding L1, and he's just not moving. Now he's moving. So weird. I think there is fatigue. Yeah, he. Um, I didn't let go, and now he just stopped walking again. I mean, he stopped running again. That's annoying. Okay. Off we go. I need a reforger. I gotta test my theory out. So we're pretty much at in the shoe, right? We're in the shoe lift, ground level, going up. Uh-oh. 
I've actually seen a little bit past this part and then I quit. I couldn't get through it. We got another save point. We got the shoe command. There he is. Of course. Have to go it alone, huh? That's where I just came from. Can't really do anything else. Okay. Would have been cool to have a reforge station or something so I could just... Uh, I want to test out my theory. There you go. My theory here. Don't want to craft the skunk gun if I don't have to. See, it uploads them. But is it required? Good. Pristine converter. Don't tell me that, boy. Alright, so... So I need a lot, a lot of credits. Okay, no worries. We'll save them up. Well, I'm glad it didn't force me to use it. Because that would have been frustrating. Oh my gosh, what happened to my green screen? I'm gonna get hit in the face. Ow. Ow. How in the world? Nope. Oh, he's dead. Ugh, I gotta heal. Am I healing? I'm stuck. Dang it. Okay. I have an idea, actually, but it would kind of... I don't know. I mean, I could use the telekinesis to pull them in towards me, but to me, that'd count as a floor hazard, you know? Like, I'm just using gravity to kill them. So, yeah, I don't know if that counts. I wouldn't... I won't. I'm not going to do it. Let's go ahead and upload these schematics again, and then we're going to sell everything. It's 500 buckaroos. The walk around, okay. You can't mantle or vault over, every, vault over everything. See, I was thinking to use my... Uh, grip glove to pull the enemies in. I feel like that's kind of cheating. Alright, one at a time, please. He just died? How are they dying?
I'm not gonna complain about that. I didn't do anything weird. I just pulled him in. I am gonna mark that though, because that was very odd. I think that was a glitch, like glove glitch or something? I don't know. That was really strange though, either way. I'll take it. I didn't deal damage. I mean, they just deactivated. AI just ceased to exist. Oh no, this part is rough. Got a, oh, battery pack. Why are they giving me so many battery packs? I'm not gonna be able to use them. Like at all. You know what I should do? Oh, it's, they're gone. Actually, no, because I'm gonna check to see if they're still there. Ah, okay, they're locked out. I didn't stomp on their corpses, so it's my fault. Get all that health. We'll grab the fuse thing. Lovely. Can't see Donk. That'll do the trick. Look at all these heals, baby. That's three. I mean, that's all I really care about anyways. Holding on to those things is the key. I'll take your implant. All right, let's see if they can come up to me. I doubt it, actually. Let me see if I can go this way. Oh gosh. Well, that wasn't dizzying at all. Okay, he's, he is here, he is here. How did you still follow through? I don't think so. Hand cannon ammo. What's happening? Oh! Can they reach me up here? Really? They sure can. This fat bastard. No, I fell off. Oh gosh. He's so big! Okay. Why won't you die, bro? Gah, get wrecked. Getting acided from the side, too. Okay. He has no parts anymore. And still, he's giving me a little fight. I'm going to go ahead and use one of these 50,000 heals I have. See if I can bust him in here. No, 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 no. Hell yeah, okay. That works. Where'd the other guy go? What? What's the purpose of this thing? I'm confused. Still being attacked. Why is nothing happening? Oh, I'm dead. Dang it. Okay, I think it sends me all the way back. I don't know. That's confusing. They just uh, kind of stopped. Alright, we gotta do this whole gauntlet all over again. Really? 
Okay, he's dead. That's what I'm talking about. Get that health. I thought that. Oh my gosh, what happened here? I can't see anything right now. Okay. I think he's dead. That really hurt me, though. The big guy can actually come up here. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. They can too. Get wrecked. What is happening? No, I missed. How are you not dead? I'm gonna heal right here. Tactical heal. I don't know if like the other bros are just gonna come or not. They come from up top. Oh my gosh. Get wrecked. Oh my gosh. Okay, don't push me back anymore. Callisto credits. Door still locked. Lovely. Get wrecked. Okay. No, don't get killed, don't get killed, don't get killed. No way. That was probably the last enemy, too. No way. Alright. Let's try that again. I'm gonna stay up here if I can. Oh my gosh, where does he come from? Get up there. Up. Oh, okay. No one told you to fall down. And get out of here. Is he dead yet? Good gosh. Nope, he's still alive. Okay, those two are dead. Waiting for the big guy. The fat guy. Ah, what? Seriously. Big boy. He's coming back for more. For seconds. Oh, we traded there. Traded again. And I'm dead. It got a little disorienting there because they had the big guy and then I think the other spitter came up there. Alright. 
There he is. He just comes from nowhere. Down below. Just teleports. Should be a falling attack. Just saying. How are you not dead? I don't know where the big dude comes from. Oh my gosh, what the hell? No way. Two hit. How are you not dead yet? I'm gonna heal. Go ahead and top off. Cause we got those two spitters. And then we got some other fools. How are you not dead, bro? Like, I'm gonna die swinging. I'm coming back up here. Single file. He's dead. Got jacked up. I'm blocking. I'm dodging, I mean. Heal. Alright, I am hurting so bad right now. Should have no parts left. Is that it? That was ridiculously ridiculous. None of them have heals. What a disaster. Okay. That dude must have just died trying to get to me. Oh gosh. Well, that was scary. No health though, still. Still gonna be in cheap in the health department. Guess we'll go up the stairs. I thought there was gonna be like another path or something. Activate shoe controls. I guess in a moment. Let me see if there's any other credits that I'm able to grab or maybe some uh, pristine converters, things like that. Energy converter right there. Uh, nothing in those glass cases. That sucks. Would have loved to get a little health. Alright, let's go ahead and uh, see what we can sell. Get rid of all our ammo. Alright, we're getting closer. I mean, we have 800 credits. 
We need 2,700 to get the max damage for the stun baton. So, I mean, we're making some progress. Slowly but surely. Alright. Take elevator down to the cell. Where the hell's the elevator? Uh, oh, here you go. Lovely. Oh, man, this guy. We got another spitter. Those are fun. And we can stealth it, right? Yeah, maybe we can stealth it. Oh gosh. Okay. He's got friends. So as soon as they turn around, which might be never. Are you serious? They don't see me. Okay, that's good at least. But we gotta get the big guy to turn the other way. He's inching closer and closer to me. Yep, he knows where I'm at. Oh my gosh, I don't know what happened there. Get wrecked. Get killed. Okay, there you go. Oh, lovely. Mm-hmm. Nope. Get punched in the face. Oh my gosh, he's on fire. Okay, he got f cut in half. Dodge! It's not really as a makeshift dodge. It worked! Oh my gosh. I got health as well. What a great drop. Where the hell did this guy come from? Okay, what am I doing? Free the inmate? Here. Well, that was awesome. The stun baton's pretty good, but, um, man, the dodging isn't that good if, for whenever you're having to up against projectiles. Because you have to, like, I, I, I just hold L1 and then I press circle so that he kind of does, like, a lazy crouch. That's as good a strafe as I can get. And I hate this character out here. Literally, nowhere else she could have been hiding. Take that as a no. A word of advice, though. Don't try. Not when it's needed. <laughs> He's all angry looking. All right, well, that was terrible. Um, now we're locked in here. Thank you. He's a very loyal friend, though. I mean, oh, did I get a health upgrade? That's what it looked like. All right, sweet. So now, let's uh, escape the shoe. And so far, we've been doing pretty good. I mean. The only uh, damage that I've dealt has been with the stun baton. We're in the second chapter, I think, right now. So, I mean, I think we're making some great progress. Um, I don't use any... If I do use the power glove or the GRP, the grip glove, I'm not using any, uh, I'm not using any like, hazards or anything like that, environmental hazards to kill the enemies. I'm just using it to hold them in place or bring them to me so I can punch them or hit them with my baton. So, it's been working really good. 
I'm just curious to see. I've never actually beat the game. You know, I only played it a few hours normally this weekend, and uh, I don't even know if it's possible to beat it using a baton only, but I'm certainly going to try. All right, tram station, lovely. Whoa! Gotta be patient, otherwise you just get, you trade hits and it's just not worth it. I got greedy at the end there as I'm talking about being patient, but I do what I want. There's one of those little uh, face hugger bastards to just push this bucket over. Ugh. Don't like them. Blame the tram now. You'll have to sneak out the way you came in. Look for a vent in the far corner. All right. A vent in the far corner. that awesome oh, those little bastards yeah I thought it was the one on the left break through fool okay, that worked you know what oh son I didn't know you could crush those okay I didn't do anything Maybe just the ones that are alive. <laughs> that works for me. More shimmy. I mean, to me, it's just an opportunity for jump scares, really. It's... What is that? Uh-uh. No! I gotta heal, man. I'm gonna get killed. I am going to die by these little bastards. I gotta heal right now. No! Go back, go back, go back. Right here. And then heal. Down. There. Golly, it takes forever to heal. Okay, here goes. Crunch. I'm swinging like a man. Oh my gosh. I need to see this guy. Alright, I'm pressing triangle like as fast as humanly possible. Thank you for dying. Crystal credit. I mean, that's great, but I need health. Uh, I can't fit in there. Oh, I can squeeze through here. All right. Now where do we go? B. Are we going to the water? Oh my gosh. Oh, what the hell? Where'd you come from? Where did he come from? I'm hurting right now. I'm gonna hope that I get an enemy that drops health gel. If not, I'll go. Stealth. Oh my gosh, that didn't work. Alright. I was trying to be stealthy, but yeah, you know. Doesn't always work that way. How many more he heal health gels do I have? Just one. Okay, that's fantastic. That last sequence was just a butt whooping. Alright. What 
this idiot. I don't like the robots. Not one bit. Top off my health. He's way over there. Used ranged weapons? I can't. This is a challenge run. Don't you know? Oh my gosh. Turn left, turn left, turn left. He's not turning. Stay right there, sir. Why? No, no, no. I'm, uh, uh I'm going this way. Catch you later. Totally bypassed that guy. I don't know if he can chase me, but I don't want to find out. Hey, you. They love going in these vents, man. All right, next checkpoint, look at us go. Yeah, I have no clue what he said. All right, that's dangerous looking. Um, I'm sure we're gonna get jump scared here, right? Cause it's a super long, super narrow pass. All we can do is shimmy. Waiting for a hand to just be like, <laughs> All right. For those of you just tuning in, we're doing a stun baton only challenge run. I have not even beaten this game before, but I plan to, using only a baton. And it's going to be glorious. Let's see. Can I pull this too? So I can use all the other items, but I just can't deal damage with anything other than the stun baton. So even if I use the glove, for, uh, the grip glove, I can just use it to hold them in place, but I can't throw them into environmental hazards or anything like that because that would be dealing damage with the glove indirectly, and that's not allowed. Oh my gosh. Get out in the open. Yes, right there, right there, right there. Dude, I'm dead. Uh. As much as as an emphasis as there is on the melee combat, it, it is lacking, man. It is lacking. Like, you don't have a dedicated dodge button. I don't know. That's just... The left stick, which you used to move, is also used to dodge, also used to block. It's just really awkward. It's, it's done... I'd say pretty poorly, actually, but I think the graphics um, and the environment is cool, but it's not like it's unique or innovative because Dead Space did it, I don't know, 15 years ago, maybe more. So, it's, I mean, it's fun. I like the game, but it's not, you know, one of my favorites or anything like that. It is an uh, enjoyable Game. And they overdo the jump scares so much that like, I, I, I fear nothing now. I'm like, I'm not afraid of anything. Alright, let's see. Lovely. Oh, you would have thought. Okay, I got him. Is it going to come back? I'm running. No. Oh, that works. That works. And because this is obviously, like, just a sequence I have to go through, it's not like I'm... I didn't use the glove or whatever, and I can always knock them into with me melee or something into this meat grinder thing. Yes! I love it. Okay, I'm, let's get out of here quickly before we become ground beef of the human variation. 80-20. Alright, we're going to keep walking through... I see snow. 
It's pretty. That's the ship hanger, I guess. Lemon squeeze. Yeah, all right, cool. Well, let's hope that nothing jumps out at us. Yeah, he's like a bro, man. Like, he could have, well, he does need a pilot to get out of here, but even so, he's been incredibly helpful, so. Uh, we're going to keep working our way through here. We haven't fired one bullet yet. We haven't. Oh, we got all the way to Habitat, too. So that's the third uh, chapter, I think. That's awesome. So you know what I'm going to do? I'm actually going to stop it here because I've been going for about you know two and a half hours. I need to get some time to get some food in me and then also go uh, take care, run some errands so I can come back and... I'll be working on a video on my, uh, I guess we'll call it Inhuman Universe, which is my the cha name of the channel. It's designated for um, like how to beat certain sci-fi monsters, challenges, things like that. But anyways, if you guys are enjoying this uh, stream, be sure to follow. Um, I do challenges every uh, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday on different games. And the weekly challenge is then posted on the YouTube channel where it says challenge runs there, Inhuman IRL. I also do lore and theories on a bunch of different games so be sure to check those out anyways you guys are awesome uh, hopefully if you watch for 30 minutes or more you got the uh, the gore package drops um, in the beginning I had some weird audio issues but it looks like I was able to fix my mic in the middle of the stream something happened with the settings on the actual physical mic itself I had to kind of mess around with those and now it's all good to go but anyways thank you guys for uh, dealing with that but anyways we're all good now uh, I'm gonna be continuing this challenge run on Wednesday uh, today I'll be focusing on posting some YouTube content for you guys' it's pleasure. We got some God of War Ragnarok theories coming up. We got uh, a troll uh, review on how to defeat that monster in the number one movie on Netflix right now. Uh, so we got a bunch of stuff coming out uh, here actually today and tomorrow. And then of course you can look forward to the next or part two of the Stun Baton Only Challenge Run on Wednesday. Um, so anyways, you guys are awesome. Thank you so much for your love and support. And until next time, it's the Inhuman One signing out. I'll catch you guys next time.